In this video, we will be looking at some of the causes and quick fix solutions to the BSOD error code 0 xc 428 I have compiled a comprehensive list of verified and working solutions that take less than 5 minutes to get through, make sure to watch this video till the end for a bonus. If you're looking for a simple solution to fix any error code with a couple of clicks, the Restorer Repair tool is the fastest and easiest solution to fix all Windows error codes. You can download Restoro at errorcodestop.com slash Restoro. We will also share the link in the description below. Ok, now let's get into the video. What causes a blue screen of death? This BSOD error affects computers running on Windows 7, 8, and 10 preventing you from carrying out regular tasks on the computer. Let's look at some of the main reasons that cause BSODs. Number 1. Hardware or software changes. A recently installed software or hardware could have introduced an incorrectly signed or corrupted file to your system, resulting in booting issues. Once the operating system detects such files, it flags them as malicious software and immediately generates the blue screen of death. Oftentimes, new hardware or software can have unverified digital signatures. Once Windows identifies these unverified signatures, it prevents you from booting up your device until the problem is fixed. Number 2. An outdated boot manager. ABSOD can be caused if something goes wrong during Windows installation or update or when you install a newer Windows version without removing the old one, resulting in a glitch by affecting boot files. Number 3. Disconnecting the installation disk during Windows installation. The Windows installation process is a delicate procedure that can result in BSOD errors when you physically remove the installation disk before the setup is complete, it can cause system faults in the primary boot disk resulting in the error code 0xt0000428. Number 4. Using an old boot disk with a recent Windows version. Adding a hard disk with an older Windows version to a PC running a newer Windows version interferes with the booting process and causes BSOD problems. How to resolve error code 0xc0000428 Without wasting any further time, let's get into the solutions part of the video. The BSOD error code 0xc0000428 can make your device inaccessible, it is best to resolve the glitch as soon as possible using the following four methods. Method 1. Update your boot manager manually. As mentioned earlier, an outdated boot manager can result in ABSOD error. So, if that's the culprit for you, resolve it by updating your computer's boot manager with the following procedure. Make a bootable file in a USB flash drive. Since your PC will be unbootable due to the BSOD, you'll have to create a bootable USB drive on another PC device. Start by downloading the Windows Media Creation software and use it to make a bootable installation media. Enter the Windows Recovery Environment. Once the bootable USB flash drive is ready, connect it to the affected PC. Alter the boot order, delegating the USB drive as the boot device. Open the boot menu by pressing an appropriate key, typically the F11 or F12 button. After that, boot your PC using the USB drive, and it should open the Windows installation media. Then, choose your preferred language, keyboard input type, etc. Click on the next button. Choose repair your computer. Manually update the boot manager file. Navigate to the troubleshoot option. Click on advanced options. Then, select command prompt. Open the command prompt window, and type the following command. Once the process concludes, reboot your PC with the hard disk as the boot device and see whether you resolved the startup issue. 
Method 2, Deactivate Driver Signature Enforcement The error code 0XC000428 can occur due to unverified digital signatures in recently installed hardware or software, drivers. Disabling digital signature verification can help solve this Windows startup error. Here is how you can disable it. Boot your PC using installation media. This technique involves booting up your computer using a bootable USB drive containing the Windows installation media. This way, you can access the Windows recovery environment. For more detailed instructions on how to boot your computer using installation media, kindly refer to the first two steps discussed in method 1 above. Disable driver signature enforcement. After entering the Windows recovery environment, select repair your computer. Pick troubleshoot and subsequently, start up settings. After that, click on restart and a pop-up window will appear. Here, you'll see a list of 9 startup setting options that you can choose from using the F1 to F9 keys. Disable driver signature enforcement is listed as number 7, enter the F7 key to proceed. Restart your PC to see whether you've resolved the error code 0xc000428. Method 3, Use Startup Repair. The startup repair function is an inbuilt tool that is part of the Windows operating system. Microsoft developed this tool to help PC owners resolve software issues such as missing or corrupted system files that may affect the booting process. Here is how you can use startup repair to fix the error code 0xc000428. Boot your PC into a Windows recovery environment. Start by booting your PC using a bootable Windows installation media, and choose Repair your computer. For more detailed instruction on achieving this step, kindly refer to the first two steps in method 1 time stamped in the video. Start the Startup Repair tool. After opening the window recovery, select Troubleshoot, click on Advanced Options and subsequently choose Startup Repair to proceed. Then, You'll have to choose a user account, provide the security credentials password, and the startup tool will start searching for bootup issues. Method 4, Reinstall the Windows OS. Reinstalling Windows is the last resort when all the solutions mentioned above fail to fix error code 0xc000428. It will resolve the bootup issue and allow you to use your computer again, unless it's a hardware problem. You can use your installation disk or the bootable device by downloading a disk image for Windows 10. You can get Windows at this link. The link has been added below in the description. Steps to reinstall Windows. Boot your computer using an installation media USB drive. Start by creating a bootable Windows installation media by using the media creation tool. After that, connect the USB drive containing the installation media to your PC to boot the device. Reinstall the OS. Select the Install Now option, and the installation media will request you to provide a product key. Next, select the specific OS you wish to install, the installation type you prefer, ideally the custom option, choose the hard drive for installing Windows. Once the OS installation is complete, your computer will restart, booting up normally. If the solutions we just went over didn't work for you we recommend using Restore a Repair tool which will scan your computer and fix most errors and other PC issues. Get it at errorcodestop.com slash restoro will leave a link in the description below. If you found this video on how to fix error code 0xc000428 helpful, please don't forget to subscribe and hit that like button. Thanks for watching.